Now, whatever that we have seen so far, we have seen how to send emails uh, through the uh, node module, one of the node module program. We have seen how to uh, generate reports, right? Uh, having screenshot attached while executing our protector test, right? Now we'll be clubbing all these things and uh, we'll be using Jenkins. Jenkins is uh, one of the continuous integration tool. So now we'll be executing our protected test to Jenkins so that we can also do continuous integration, right? So what I'm trying to say, uh, let's say, I'll, I'm gonna show you a demo uh, before we uh, start uh, develop, designing this module, right? So let's say this is uh, a Jenkins GUI, right? Now if I, uh, click on this this is a uh, build now right uh, this is my protector uh, uh, module over here right i'm going to build this module i'll just click on build now and a build is scheduled if i go over here if i show you the console output of this build you're gonna see that it is actually giving a call to the const.js file and see my test has started executing so the test is completed and at the end what it will gonna do uh, it is actually going it has already generated a report right uh, and your uh, HTML report has already been generated now what we are doing we are starting a jetty server right now with uh, Allure uh, plugin you you receive a, a maven pom.xml file that contains your dependency of jetty server jetty server is a very lightweight server uh, uh this that server will actually gonna help you uh in bringing up your report through a local host to ip address right on some uh port that we will gonna configure right now what it is doing it is actually starting a jetty server at this moment and within few minutes uh once the jetty server is started it will gonna send an email email for the test results uh Results as in basically the link of that jetty server we're gonna receive so you can directly click on that link See uh, sending mail with the report of test execution and the build is successful right Now if I'll uh, go to the inbox over here uh, I'm gonna see uh, our report has been generated. Uh, this is the very recent mail that I got and this is uh, uh, Where I can see my report generated and now what you need to do is just click on this link and you can see your Allure report dashboard, right? So the we have actually executed three tests and if I go to uh, X unit, this is our automatic customer login functionality, right? This is login to the account. If you take a look at the screenshot, this is the one that we have automated in the login to the account, then validate deposits. Let us see this is from deposit. Yes, this is from deposits, right? Then we're gonna see validate withdrawals and you'll see that this is from the withdrawal, right? So by just clicking on this uh, build now of the project, right? We can execute uh, the entire thing. Uh, we can combine our uh, entire steps that we have seen uh, in different modules, right? And we can execute it in one go. Right. And this will also help us in doing continuous integration as in uh, you can configure your GitHub, your SVN repositories. You can give the URL of your repository to your Jenkins configuration. And as soon as the code is checked in, your build will be automatically triggered. Right. So let us now go inside the module and see what all that we have configured. All right.